welcome back to my channel and I'm sorry that I'm doing my intro and outro here in the car. I totally forgot to do it when I did this video. But anyway, for today's video, I'm going to be recreating my favorite, um, I guess, cafe drinks or like drinks that I always buy outside. So it's only three, so I'm going to be doing my favorite milky iced coffee. My favorite smoothie from Jamba Juice, which is Strawberry Wild, so it's going to be strawberry based. And then lastly, I have been super duper obsessed with matcha lattes. There are days when I just really look for matcha green tea. So yeah, I decided to recreate them for you guys. And yeah, let's proceed to the video. For iced coffee, we need milk, condensed milk, and any ground coffee. So I'm just gonna be setting up my coffee maker. I'm putting that lining over there. If you do have a coffee maker, you know what I'm saying. So if you don't have any coffee maker and ground coffee, that's fine. You can just use a normal black coffee or just plain coffee. So we just need one tablespoon of this ground coffee and it's going to give you one cup of black coffee. So I'm now going to be putting condensed milk on the bottom of the glass so once I add the hot brewed coffee, it's just going to incorporate really quick. So to make our coffee a lot creamier and milkier, I'm just going to add milk. And now we can add some ice. And that's our milky iced coffee. So for my strawberry wild smoothies, I'm going to need one strawberry yogurt, any yogurt drink, whether it's a blueberry yogurt or strawberry based yogurt, frozen bananas, just chop off your bananas and then put them on the freezer, and then we're going to need ice. Now we're just going to put everything on the blender or the mixer that you have at home, and then we're going to blend it all together. Now that it's all blended, we can now transfer it to our cup or bottle. For the matcha latte, we're just going to need sweetened matcha powder and powdered milk. To make one serving, we're just going to need 2 tablespoons of matcha powder and 2 tablespoons of powdered milk. Now we're just going to combine both ingredients with hot water. Then add some ice and you're good to go. That is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you again on my next one.